Power Book 2, Ghost, which was renewed for a fourth season by stars before its third had even concluded, knows it has a hit on its hands. Then, we can relax knowing that there will be another installment with Michael Rainey Jr. as character Tarek St. Patrick, who is trying to escape his father's shadow. It will have all the twists and turns that we have grown accustomed to from the crime drama series. Here's everything we know about Ghost's specific return date to television, now that we know there will be more of Tarek and company to come. Power Book 2, Ghost Season 4 Release Date, When Will It Air? Even though the much-anticipated Season 4 renewal news has already been revealed, the specific date of its release is still unknown. Rainy JR had previously guaranteed fans that they wouldn't have to wait as long as the last 16-month break, but production for Season 4 will have definitely been delayed due to the Writers Guild of America and SAFAFTRA strikes. We still don't know when Ghost's second season's production will begin, though, despite the studio striking agreements with both unions. Better news, Rainy JR told the Daily Express that he wanted to give the show and his character another 50 years. His prediction, but in all honesty, I think we still have a considerable amount of time left. We'll be here for quite some time. Hence, even though we're not precisely sure when we'll see him again, at least we don't have to worry about the studio taking the axe to Ghost. When we get all the information regarding the release date, be sure to come back to Novelflix. Power Book 2, Ghost Season 4 cast, who's in it? We also learned of an intriguing casting development along with the renewal announcement. Michael Eath, who viewers may remember from the humorous Netflix series The Woman in the House Across the Street from the Girl in the Window, has been cast as Detective Don Carter. According to reports, the new guy on the street was a rising star in the NYPD who was headed for police commissioner until his wife was murdered in a shootout between rival drug gangs. Bowing to make the streets safer, Carter traded in his tie for a Kevlar vest and now leads an elite NYPD drug task force that elicits tangible results against drug-related violence, says a description of the new detective. Nothing can replace his departed love, despite the fact that his accomplishments have garnered notable public recognition. Naturally, we may anticipate Rainy Jr. S. return as Tarek in addition to the new investigator. Unfortunately, though, Lorenzo Tejada S.R. will not be returning for season 4 since Monet placed a reward on his head, which ultimately led to his demise. It's expected that the following main cast members will make a comeback. Lovell Adams Gray as Drew Tejada. Woody McLean as Kane Tejada. Latoya Tonodio as Diana Tejada. Gianni Paolo as Braden Weston. Cliff Method Man Smith as David McLean. Shane Johnson as Cooper Sachs. Towards the end of season 3, we saw Joseph Sikora's murderous character Tommy Egan pop up on the show, which indicates we should always expect the unexpected during the show, particularly as ghosts can tap deep into the bench of the power universe. After Tommy's fiancé was slain in the sixth and final season of Power, Tarek's mother Tasha was the target of Tommy's return to exact retribution. Sikora said of Tommy's desire for vengeance in an interview with TV Line, Tommy is not a very forgiving or forgetful person. Even though he struggles with both of those issues, Tommy seems to be aware that forgetting typically entails taking care of unfinished business. In the run-up to the upcoming season, there may be more casting announcements, so stay tuned. Power Book 2, Ghost Season 4 Plot, What Will Happen? Although the specific opponents Tarek will face in the upcoming season of the show are unknown, Ely's casting announcement appears to offer a major hint. Detective Don Carter, who leads the elite NYPD Narcotics Task Squad, sounds like a personal enmity to Tarek, so we can expect him to be a pain in his side. Be prepared for encounters with Tarek and his illegal business, which could result in the Enterprise being completely destroyed. In other news, Tanodio's Diana had a lot going on in Season 3. Among the numerous adversities that made her mature very quickly were the death of her father and her imprisonment. Regarding her role, Tanodio remarked, a woman, adding that Diana has assumed her authority. She is at a loss for options. Someone is pushing her in that direction. It's now time for her to completely embrace the role and apply all of her skills to become the boss she has been trained to be. We should certainly anticipate more consequences from Lorenzo's untimely demise in Season 4. Woody McLean told Uprox of how Lorenzo's passing impacted his character Kane, saying, I think it affected a lot. Lorenzo, in my opinion, was the family's unifying factor. Whether it was Diana attending school or him being incredibly supportive of Drew and his relationships, he wanted the best for everyone. I just believe that Lorenzo served as the family's glue, and that the family is literally splitting apart now that he is no longer there. I believe that having Lorenzo was crucial to our success, and that without him, things would only go more to the left. As the seasons pass, Tarek is starting to resemble his father more and more. Furthermore, an appearance from somewhere else in the Power Book universe is always possible. Power Book 2, Ghost Season 4 trailer, when will it be released? Although the season's filming has begun, we currently don't have any footage of what's coming up next, but perhaps we will soon. Thanks for watching. If you liked this video, make sure to like and subscribe for more.